Well, hello everyone. My name is Jean and the name of my channel is Jean Home Decor and more. Welcome back and welcome if you are new. Welcome to another Tablescape Tuesdays. Tablescape Tuesdays are hosted by the Grace Life DIY Home Decor and Amethyst Adventures. I will be posting the links to these ladies' channels in the description box down below. Swing on by their channels, y'all, and show them some love. Let them know that Jean Home Home decor more sent you over well today guys I am going to share with you two ideas for tablescapes I have one with a small centerpiece which is ideal for if you really want to look across and talk to and laugh and chop it up with the person that you're eating with okay so that's this one and then we'll move on after this one to the second tablescape so for this one, I'm using my everyday dinner plates. And what I decided to do was to use a clear bread and butter plate over top of it so that you can see the floral design in the center of the dinner plate. So this is minimally decorated and you guys know how I do. Y'all know I'm a minimalist. But it's simplistic, and I think it's elegant. It's just perfect for, you know, your kitchen. There's nothing new on this table, Scape. As you guys know, I just go down into my arsenal, and I just shift and move things around. You know, and that's what I like about tablescapes. It gives you an opportunity to be creative. And we all have that creative side to us. So, you know, if you like, you know, styling tables, come on and join us, y'all. Join Tablescape Tuesdays. But I thought this turned out quite well. I love the beautiful blue hydrangeas. And my husband is here with me, and you guys hear he turns the TV on. What us gonna do, y'all? What us gonna do? But I thought this turned out quite nicely. Mm -hmm. All right, guys. Let's move on to tablescape number two. So look at this, guys. Tablescape number two is more dramatic because the centerpiece is higher, the floors are more full, and what I wanted to do here is use different shades of blue or hues of blue. You know, um, I'm using different prints between the florals that are on the dinner plates and the prints in the ginger jar. And I thought all these different hues of blue, you know, were really, really pretty. So I have some different layering going on between the blue woven placemat the braided placemat over top of that, the rustic um, charger, as you can see there, my dinner plate and bread and butter plate that allows you to see to the floral design on the dinner plate. But with the darker cloth napkins and the darker blues and the, you know, ginger jar, I thought that turned out quite nicely. And I hope you do too. Now this place setting is more ideal if you want to just showcase your table setting. So let me know what you think, guys. I hope you like this tablescape. If you do, please consider to give me a big thumbs up. I really would appreciate that. Drop a comment down in the comment box below. Subscribe to my channel, y'all. I need some subscribers. And hit that notification bell, not one time, but two times, so that you can be notified every time that I upload a video. Also, I will be posting the hashtag Tablescape Tuesdays 24 so that you can see all of the other co-content creators and their contributions to Tablescape Tuesdays. You won't want to miss out on that. They have some fabulous ideas. Five, three, zero, six, eight, one, five, three, zero, 
I hope that you guys have an amazing day. And until the next video, peace out.